Something big is brewing inside Samsung's labs, and it's not just another incremental update. One UI 8.5 is quietly reshaping how Galaxy devices will feel and behave, and from early leaks, this isn't your typical mid-cycle refresh. It's a massive leap forward built directly on Android 16 and could completely flip Samsung's software playbook on its head. Hey everyone, welcome back. Sam here. If you're new to the channel, make sure to hit that like button, share the video with your tech loving friends and subscribe for more exciting Galaxy updates coming your way. Now let's dive in. Here's the twist. One UI 8.5 isn't just being reserved for the future Galaxy S26 lineup. Samsung's testing it right now on the S24 series. That means users of current gen phones might experience the next gen Android 16 interface way sooner than expected. The testing first began on the Galaxy S26 Ultra, but fresh leaks confirm internal builds running on the Galaxy S24 Plus 2. So yes, One UI 8.5 is already alive behind the scenes. And this time, Samsung isn't sticking to its old rhythm of X1 and X1.1 updates. Instead, it's going straight for 8.5, a clear sign that something much deeper is changing. Early firmware spotted in July left no doubt the Galaxy S26 Ultra's internal software carried the unmistakable 8.5 tag. Insiders say this version will launch first with the Galaxy S26 Pro, S26 Edge, and S26 Ultra, likely in January 2026 but the early testing on older models shows Samsung's new approach to updates is already in motion. Now here's where it gets exciting. The One UI 8.5 update is expected to reach a massive lineup of devices. That includes not just the Galaxy S25 family, S25 plus Ultra Edge and Fan Edition, but also the S24 and S23 generations, along with the S22 and even the S21 FE. Foldables like the Z Fold 7 Flip 7, Fold 6 Flip 6, and older Fold 5 Flip 5 are also on the list. Even tablets like the Tab S11 Ultra and Tab S10 Plus are expected to join in, along with the A-series lineup like the A56, A55, A36, and A35. In short, Samsung's not leaving anyone behind this time. But the real story here is how One UI 8.5 feels. Leaked test builds reveal smoother animations that give every swipe and scroll that buttery soft finish. App launches, notification pulls, and quick toggle motions look cleaner, faster, and more fluid, almost as if Samsung rebuilt the visual engine from scratch. It's that kind of difference you notice instantly, even if you can't explain why it feels so good. Speaking of visuals, the redesigned quick settings panel is turning heads. Users will be able to freely resize, rearrange, or completely remove toggles and widgets. Whether you prefer a vertical layout or a clean horizontal one, One UI 8.5 adapts to you, not the other way around. Combine that with brand, new lock screen clock styles, three confirmed so far, and Samsung's taking customization to new levels. It's like the software finally learned how to match your personality. One UI 8.5 also brings a hidden gem that fans have been waiting for, the predictive back gesture. Remember that little preview animation that shows exactly where your swipe will take you. It's finally going mainstream. No more hidden lab settings, no extra toggles. It'll be active by default. Once you try it, regular navigation feels ancient. And Samsung hasn't forgotten about its core apps either. The gallery app is getting a fresh makeover, ditching the cramped look for bigger, easier to tap buttons. Album headers will now preview your latest photo or video, giving the app a livelier, more personal touch. It's subtle, but gives off that premium. iOS like polish without losing the Galaxy vibe. What's even more intriguing is how quietly Samsung's been rolling this out internally. Developers hint that the company's blending AI-driven optimization into the system, meaning smoother background app handling, better battery control, and more responsive animations. None of this is official yet, but all signs point to Samsung using Android 16's under the hood power to make One UI 8.5 feel like the most refined Galaxy experience yet. And here's something even cooler. With One UI 8.5 testing on the Galaxy S24 lineup already confirmed, we might see Samsung releasing the update in two waves, one for the current generation and one alongside the S26 launch. That could make One UI 8.5 the first major Android 16 based interface to roll out to existing phones before the next flagship even hits the shelves. From the leaked firmware to the testing expansion, everything about One UI 8.5 feels like Samsung is rewriting the rules of software updates. It's not just another patch, it's a statement, a promise that Galaxy users, old or new, are getting a smarter, smoother, and more future-ready experience. So, which feature are you most excited about? The refreshed design, the new gestures, or the deeper personalization? Drop your thoughts below, I'd love to know.
And if you enjoyed this deep dive into One UI 8.5, make sure to tap that like button, share it with your friends, and subscribe so you don't miss the next big reveal. Big things are coming, and this is only the beginning. Peace out, everyone. Until next time, stay tuned and stay tech savvy.